Let's go to Romans chapter 12 verses or verse 18. To the left is the King James Version, to the right is the Expanded Bible. If it be possible, as much as lieth in you, live peaceably with all men. Now, this says men, but women as well. Like, how would it sound? <laughs> Only live in peace with men, but women, no. <laughs> you have to raise hell with women, no. So, you have to live, if it be possible, as much as lieth in you, live peaceably with all men and women. So, what is this saying? We know that there are people who love to start up conflict, that loves to get offended easily, that loves to get angry quickly. With those people there, if they say anything to you, <coughs> if they say anything to you, the best thing to do is to back down and don't say anything. Just shake your head, you know, like, okay, okay, all right, all right. Because, and some people may say, well, if you keep on backing down, they are going to continue to push you over or you may say that if a person backs down they are very weak or they are a wimp or whatever else it is not about being weak it is not about being a wimp it is about pleasing god god does not want us to argue so when we argue with another person that is a sin it is not about being a wimp. It is not about being weak. It is about doing what God wants you to do because if you don't, and I have said this many times already, if you don't do what God tells you to do, you are in sin and you are going to get cursed. You are going to reap what you sow. So nine times out of 10, when a person comes to me in a very crazy way, I back down. Now, you can call me a punk or a loser or a bum, <laughs> whatever you want to call me. I want to please God, not people. I want to do what is right by God because look, in the end, who runs the world? God. So my enemies that may criticize me by being weak or whatever else, they don't rule the world. So why should I be worried about pleasing them? I should be concerned about pleasing God. I pray that this makes sense. Always, always back down to avoid conflict. If someone is arguing with you or trying to start up some mess with you, back down. There is nothing wrong with backing down. Say that you are sorry or whatever else, even when you are not wrong. You may say, Kevin, well, that is too much. I can't go that far. If someone is wrong, I need to tell them that they are wrong. Now, if you can talk to a person and it is not going to be like a huge argument yes then you should speak to that person but if you know that it is going to be a huge argument the best thing to do is to back away to back off like for instance you know there are some people who may message me on Facebook or matches me on this YouTube channel here and they may say blah 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 and then I would say well you know the truth is this and this isn't this and that and if they get like an attitude toward me and whatever else many of the time I am not going to say anything I am not going to say anything 
because there is no point. Like for instance, like another thing happened where this one person was doing something that they know that is wrong. And it came to my mind to come to that person and tell that person to not do what they were doing. But it also came to my mind as well that if I were to come to that person and tell that person that, that person is going to get an attitude and an an attitude or raise their voice or make like a big issue out of something small. So I said to myself, well, let me do something else. Because we have to understand that many people know that they are doing wrong. They just don't care. So if they don't care, if you come to them it is going to be a huge argument or something really bad. So, I pray that this makes sense. Try to live in peace with everyone. With everyone. Out of everybody that I speak to, perhaps there is a handful of people who I can really say, hey, you know, like this thing is wrong or you should change this or you should change that you know i am not trying to be mean to you or anything like that but everyone else man i have to be careful what i say and how i say it and everything because they are looking for anything to get offended by anything like it's crazy <laughs> and like I said with people like that in many cases it is how they feel first then everything else like if they believe that <clears throat> you are saying something to hurt them or even if you are not trying to hurt them but if it sounds close to something that sounds bad about them they are going to get offended like hey what are you talking about what are you trying to say well if you just listen to what i'm saying then you will understand what i am trying to say but we have to know that there are people like that and we have to be smart about what we do yes Talking to that person is not a bad thing, but if that person is going to make a huge issue about something really small, you are better off not saying anything to that person. Now, in some cases, we may have to say something, but like, just be really careful. This is what I am trying to say. Be very, very careful. Because, you know, some people may have gotten hurt when they were young. So they say to themselves, now, hey, if anyone comes to me and it sounds like a tiny bit bad, I am just going to blow up because I have to make sure that I never get hurt like that back when I was young or years ago. Which is quite silly, but... I pray that this makes sense. God bless.